Today I am doing PRP for lip injections to help make our patient's lips even more beautiful. And sometimes people are a little bit afraid of filler, so this is a great option. And PRP stands for platelet-rich plasma, so I've already drawn her blood, I've spun it down, I had numbing cream on her lips, and I'm now going to inject the platelets into her lips. So I'm gonna just wipe off the numbing cream, and hopefully they're nice and numb now. That numbing cream has been on for a while. We're gonna wipe it down with a little antiseptic here. And so her, her lips are gonna swell. That's totally typical. And then in about two or three days, she's gonna be like, oh, where did it all go? But that's when the magic starts happening. And the platelets are gonna to signal to her stem cells to migrate to where they are, and they're gonna make her lips even more luscious, but over time. Okay, you ready? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna start right here. One, two, three. And there's never a risk with, with PRP, because it's your own blood. So I'm not using anybody else's blood. It's all you. And there's no risk of occlusions. You know, you could get bruised, but you could bruise with everything. But I don't want you taking any arnica or anything like that in case you do bruise, because I want all the inflammation to happen, because the inflammation will make the stem cells migrate to where the platelets are. So let's go to the other side. You doing okay? Mm-hmm. Oh, good. The numbing cream is good? Yep. Awesome. Ready? One, two, three. You're doing so great. And like I said, they like to they like to swell with this, but you'll probably like the swelling actually. They look even cuter. And so now I'm gonna do the bottom. You ready? Mm -hmm. One, two, three, ooh la la. Here we go. And we don't want the bottom to feel neglected. And again, there's the nice part about this is very natural. I'm not injecting anything that's not your own. Sometimes people are just a little bit wary of filler. I love filler, but I also love PRP. And there you go. Easy peasy. So afterwards, she doesn't need to really do anything. She's just gonna enjoy how they're cutely swollen. <laughs> and she's gonna go around and see all the girlfriends that she wants to show her lips to. And then, but in about two or three days, that swelling will be gone. And then, like I said, the stem cells are gonna come over and make her make new collagen, elastin, and it'll be even more beautiful because it's a very natural improvement over time. So your maximum results are gonna be in about three months. I usually recommend people to do these injections a couple, two to three times. So spaced about six to eight weeks apart. So if you wanna find out more about PRP for your lips or anywhere, you can put it in your cheeks, your nasolabial folds, anywhere, you can find us online at rejuvenationmdmedspa.com.